This haunted abandoned house is Road. on Derry Road and the Iklam movie is based in the town of Derry. What was locked up in here? What's up guys, I'm Old Sarge, and welcome back to another late night video. Right behind me is one of the most spookiest houses I've seen in my entire life. We're actually on a road called Dairy Road, and there is a really scary house right behind me. It's abandoned. I've never been inside, I have no history about this, but I do want to go inside and see what the heck is cooking inside of this place. Well, even the outside looks really messed up. Yeah, the outside is the coolest part about it. Hopefully the inside is even cooler. So what do you guys say we jump in with Carlo and Aldo and see what's inside? So here's the cool thing about this house. If you guys remember, the It Clown is based in the town of Derry. I'm on the road of Derry right now. And we find this abandoned house, really, really creepy abandoned house. And I'm hoping the It Clown is not inside. Is the it clown gonna be in there? What? The it clown, is he gonna be in there? Yeah, dude, this place looks really freaking eerie. You guys don't know why I'm saying the it clown. Why? Well, do you guys remember the name of the town of the it clown? No. Derry, look where we are, Derry Road. No. This, oh this haunted abandoned house is Road. on Derry Road and the it clown movie is based in the town of Derry. Oh my god, how, how crazy is that? What? That, that is so cool. Oh my god, yo bro, there might be an it clown living inside. <laughs> it is super late right now it's almost like three o'clock in the morning we've actually been road tripping and we found this place so this is pretty interesting to me if there's a way in then we're gonna go in and film inside and see what we can find inside i have no clue what to expect from this place like i said i didn't even know it existed what the oh my god that's like a freaking tarantula yeah. so i think we might have found a way Holy into this abandoned shit. it clown house it's actually massive. Let's check it out how massive oh, right it, it went under the thing. Alright, you guys made it inside into this really creepy house. We made it in through the bathroom. There's a hole in the wall. Which is crazy. And this house looks very, very spooky. Oh my god. I really hope the it clown's not in here. Hey it clown, my boy, are you here? Guys, look at how creepy this place is. There's an upstairs. Oh my god. What the hell is all this? I've never been to this abandoned house before. The floor does not feel safe at all. Holy shit, it's been destroyed. Looks like somebody also threw a party here at one point in time. Wow, what are the odds of that? A clown on the wall. That's creepy. Don't know how long this video is gonna be. I need you guys to make sure to subscribe to this channel if you're just tuning in. We go to crazy places, find the most scariest places, and spend the night there. So tonight we're inside of this It Clown house. The reason why we're calling it the It Clown house is because it kind of looks like the It Clown's house, and it's right on Derry Road, which is crazy. As you guys can see, the only way in and out of this place was the way we came in. Everything is pretty much sealed tight. There's an upstairs, but I don't know if I wanna go up there all by myself. It's pretty creepy, man. It's kind of giving me like Tom a boy house vibes, but this house is definitely as old as that. If not even older, this house has got to be about 200 years old. Whoa, what's through here? Oh my God, look at this room over here. There's a couch flipped up and there's all these pillows on the ground. Things left behind. So I need you guys to keep your eyes wide open in case you spot anything in this place. Like I said, we were driving down this long road Late at night, uh, we're heading back to our Airbnb, actually. It was about uh, 45 minutes away from here. We're driving through here accidentally. I see this place. I'm like, boys, let's go and check it out. This road is called Dairy Road. Dairy Road is from the It Clown movie. This is probably the coolest, creepiest place I've seen in a long time. Did you, did you go upstairs? Yet? No, no, I ain't going upstairs yet. Is that a clown? Yeah, there's a clown oh on the wall. God. Oh my god. That's, that's the first thing I noticed when I walked in here. Is that damn clown on the wall. <laughs> what are the odds of that, man? This is too good of a coincidence. I love Yo, this. Oh, this is literally the it clown. I actually hurt my hand getting in here, but it's all good. I'm gonna make my way upstairs now. <laughs> danger. danger. Oh. There's yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold up, hold up. Are we all going up? No, no, look. It says danger, and then look. There's an eye right there. You know what? That usually that's a sign of rituals. Rituals, huh? Yeah. This is a scary ass place. You know what really scares me about this place? is that there's only one way in and out and it's a very tiny one. Like, if we have to squeeze out of here, we're all screwed. So if something does attack us in here, we have to stand our ground and fight. 
Hello? Anyone here? Oh man, I'm on edge right now. If anybody's here, please don't hurt me. I hope so. <laughs> I hope so. All right, so this is a bedroom. Making my way down this creepy hallway. My goodness, it literally looks like something out of the It Clown movie. How crazy is that? Whoa, and it continues going. There's like seven bedrooms up here. No way. Yeah. Wow. Wow, oh my god, look at all this. Look at this wall. This closet. Wow. I, I haven't seen anything this cool in a very long time. Like you guys know, I travel to a lot of abandoned places, but the vibes I'm getting from this place is ancient. And I absolutely love that. Like look at the wallpaper. Everywhere you go, there's creepy wallpaper. So these are the only two rooms that I have not and checked out. Oh wow, there's a staircase here. That goes back downstairs. A lot of things were left behind actually in this room, but it looks like it was mostly destroyed by kids. Whoa, there's a creepy attic up there. I don't even want to go inside of that. So I, I don't know how long this video is going to be. I don't think it's going to be long because it's super late. We're dead tired, but we're like, hey, why not stop off quickly, film this place and get the hell out of here. Bro, this place is scary. <laughs> Not gonna lie, it's actually scary. Tell me what you think it is. There's something in the closet? Is that blood? You tell us. I don't know. Like kind of looks like blood, yeah, that actually does look like blood. <clears throat> What's really strange about this abandoned house is that all the blinds are still here, then they got this blackout blinds, and then they have boards on all the windows. So it's almost like whoever was in here, they don't want whoever comes in here to leave. I don't know, it's just that's just the vibes that I get from this place. You know, I just realized that I haven't even seen an entrance to a basement here. There might be something down there. What happened? I found a secret door in the closet. Really? Yeah. I looked in all those closets, I didn't see a secret door. Maybe it goes down to the It Clown's lair. A secret door? Oh, I didn't see that. Whoa. Oh, I, I know where the basement is too. You know it? Yeah. I didn't, I didn't see the stairs. You know where we walked in? Yeah. In the, the laundry room? Mm -hmm. Where I started off my video? Yeah. It's right there, where that door is. Oh, shit. Oh, what is that? Look at all this. Indian feathers and teepees and kayaks on the wall. I like this. I like this wallpaper. Look at the floor, bro. The checkered floors. Oh. These are really cool. The boys' room? The girls' room? Yeah, it looks like a boys' room because there's Indians on the wall. Like um, Indian feathers, Indian kayak, and Indian tent. Okay, it's so more could... like a masculine vibe. Yeah. Yo, what is that smell? It smells like something died here. Yeah, that was your fart. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Oh. If I didn't get it on camera, it didn't happen. All right, let's make our way down the creepy stairs and see what's downstairs. What a tiny staircase to walk down. Wait, everyone just oh, came in. Ditching. No, we're ditching you, all right. Oh. Huh. Wait, wait for you, okay, I'll be down here. That's it, we're gonna go the house. That's it. The house is big but small at the same time. Yeah. We're back here through the kitchen. It, it, the problem is, on the outside, it looks huge. Yeah. We're, we're missing something. We, we, no way might, just... we might be missing something, yeah. Unless we go, let's go to the basement. Maybe there's another part from the basement we can get to. This way. Look at this. Let me just say, I shotgun leaving this place first. Um, I shotgun second. Be because if I leave last, I don't want to be the last one to, yeah, to leave this place. Because it's scary. Like I said, it's a very tight squeeze to get out of here through that wall. That's the only way in and out. Yeah, what is this place? I don't know, it's like a cage. There's a cage here. Well, what was locked up in here? Oh my god, dude. Is that an animal maybe? Or? I don't know, that's a big cage for an animal. Oh, look! What? A collar. Where? Right there. Whoa! I wonder what's in the basement. Carlo, is there any humans in the basement? No. Bro. They could have had a big dog here at one point. Shh. 
This is very either very stupid of us to go down in this basement. This is definitely very stupid. At least it's concrete, so it's not gonna. Why is there a tiny little crawl space here? Look. Whoa, there it's weird. What the hell? This really reminds me of the Iklam movie. Like we're going down this creepy stairs. Bro, we're about to find an alien and get attacked. I haven't seen concrete stairs in this country in basements before. I know, right? It's, it's usually just one, wooden that's stairs. A big bug. Guys, right now, bugs are the last on my waist for some reason. Like, I probably got attacked by spiders. Oh my bugs. god. It's a good thing we're not in Australia. I literally wore the wrong shoes to come into this place. I heard if you're in Australia and you get bit by a bug, you can actually, like, become paralyzed. Is that true? You can die. Yeah. They have the most poisonous spiders there. Yo, this is weird, bro. Look at this. Okay, move in. Let me it's get like in there. Happy birthday shit. Look at that. Yeah, there's party supplies down here. This is weird vibes, bro. Oh, this is crazy. Where's the well where the A-Clown comes out from? I'd like to find that. You think that actually is a well? Dude, if the A-Clown does show up, I'm gonna be like, yo, I wanna be your friend. Yeah, I'm gonna be like, hey man, let's, we're doing a YouTube video. Yeah, can, can, we, can we be friends, Mr. A-Clown? This basement gets even bigger and bigger. That's so weird. Is that it for the basement? Yeah. Oh man, this is cool. Man, have you ever been afraid to be in the basement? Because like, it's gonna collapse on you? <sighs> I mean, the way I see it, if it's gonna collapse, it would have already collapsed by now. Yeah, that's true. Yo, what the heck is this? Whoa, look at that cool old chair. Hold on, there's like a, a table. I've been sitting here and telling you guys that this place has the It Clown vibes this entire time. But here's what I want to know. I want to know if you guys agree with me. Let me know in the comments below if this house gives you the It Clown vibe. First of all, it's on a street called Dairy Street. The It Clown show was based in a town called Dairy. What are the odds of that? Um, like, I'm not making this up. When I go outside, I'm going to show you guys the street sign. Usually, I don't show locations, but this place is pretty destroyed. Um, I really can't see any more destruction happening to this place. People do come destroy them all the time, but I think this place will be all right. It's been here for a long time. I think it'll be here for a long time after this. Just don't come here. I don't recommend you guys coming here and getting hurt. It's not worth it. So you guys can let me know in the comments below if you're getting it clown vibes from this movie. And let me know if you've seen number two, because I've seen it and I thought it was awesome. Carlo has a point here. Carlo's saying this house is way too big and we're missing something. We've explored all the house, but from the outside, it looks like it's three times larger on the outside. So we might be missing some sort of secret entrance to go somewhere else in the house. Let's go find it right now. I don't want to be the last one out of the basement. Don't worry, we won't bitch you. <sighs> Maybe what we're missing is through this door here that's locked. Do so? I don't know, but there's nowhere else to go. There it, might be some hidden door somewhere. Think there could be a hidden door? Maybe. I, I checked all of that down there. I checked this little secret room here on the right. See you later, boys. <laughs> There's gotta be something. That. What the hell is that? Is That's that a, a couch? couch, yeah. Why is the couch upside down? I don't know, maybe it clown flipped it over. I, I don't think we missed anything. I think it's all it's all an illusion from the outside. I think I just solved our puzzle to why this house looks really big. Well, it's not. There is a secret part of this house that we can't get into because there's no actual physical door to it. But it's right here through that wall. That goes into another section of the house that we haven't explored. We were in the basement, we didn't see this section though. So. But where does it go? Be very careful, where you're standing not pretty, I can see it bending. All right, as you guys can see, I'm back outside now. This is what I mean by how big this house actually was from the outside. But on the inside, it doesn't, it's not that big. It's really, really weird. I guess maybe because of the shed over here, we thought it was much bigger than it is, but it's really not. Guys, check it out. The house literally has a piece of brick up there that says 1905. So that's when this house was built, all the way in 1905. That was over 100 years ago. All right, so I told you guys this place looks identical almost to the It Clown's actual house. And I told you guys that we are on Dairy Road right now. Let me show it to you guys. So there's that house right there, right? Pay attention, turning this around. Look at that dairy on that sign. Let me get a bit closer to it without dying over here. Oh. How crazy is it? Dairy Road, wow. I've never shown the address of a house, but in my opinion, this place is not gonna get any more destroyed than it already is. Here's the thing with me, I don't give up. It's literally like f almost five o'clock in the morning right now. I'm surprised how busy this intersection is where the house is. Um, we were literally driving back to our Airbnb and we're dead tired, guys. We've been filming all day. We've been doing so many different abandoned videos. We've been on a road trip, just grinding hard. But me, I'm the type, if I see, Something that looks as cool as that, something that I think you guys would love to watch. I'm gonna stop off and film it, which is why I stopped us off here today. And we actually went inside. I can't believe it was open. Yeah. I can't believe it's on Dairy Road. Yeah. I can't believe it looks almost identical to the Icon. I can't believe there's a clown picture inside the house. Like, 
You know, it's funny because yeah. when we first got onto this road, this road's a long road. We drove, we got on this road about five minutes down the road, and I seen the sign say dairy. I didn't say nothing to these two. I was like, hmm, I wonder if we can find something spooky on yeah. this road. Yeah. And, you know, behold, like we're turning on the intersection, we see the abandoned house. Now, keep in mind, we were dead tired. We were literally like, okay, let's go to bed, guys. Suddenly, they see a abandoned house. This guy's like, Mm, let's go inside. <laughs> Smash the like button. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to go download my new app, the Mo Sarji app. I'm posting exclusive content on that app. Content you guys won't be able to see on YouTube because I cannot upload on YouTube because it'll get demonetized. So that's why I've created my own app. You can become an exclusive member on the Mo Sarji app. Download it on iOS and Android or even anywhere anywhere where there's an app store. You can download the Mo Sarji app. Become an exclusive member. You can request shouties from me if you want me to give you a personal shout out on the app as well. So there's a lot of cool fun things for you guys to do on the app. So make sure you guys are always on it. Smash the like button. Go subscribe to Aldo. Go subscribe to Carlo. Their links are down below. And don't forget, subscribe to to me as well and my new vlog channel the Sarji family vlog channel link is down below peace I need you guys to know that I have a huge surprise for each and every one of you and that surprise being that I'm bringing back the haunted Tom series exclusively to the exclusive section on the most RG app I will not be uploading it to YouTube anywhere I will only be uploading these Tom haunted series apps to the exclusive section on the most RG app so what I need from you guys to do is enjoy the app, watch every video that I've been posting exclusively on the app. Every video that I post exclusively doesn't get shown on YouTube. I won't post it on YouTube. And there will be a lot of other videos that YouTube has deleted because their content is deemed not worthy of YouTube because it's either too scary or too crazy. I will be posting it on the exclusives of the app. So strap in. Buckle up. Hope you guys are ready for some epic videos dropping all month long and all year long on this app. Guys, we're here to stay. We got some new content coming out only for the app. So make sure you do become an exclusive member. And if you have tried out the 14 day free trial, good on you. Make sure to stick around because we got some new exclusive videos coming out your way. Some new Mosargy haunted cartoon series. Um, we got the Tom series coming out. We got a whole lot of other haunted and crazy content that is going to be only posted to the exclusive. So make sure you guys stick around. I love you guys. Enjoy the app. And once again, thank you so much for becoming members on my app. I'm also going to be picking somebody randomly at the end of this month that I'm going to be flying out to and meeting up and surprising in person, just like the video that I posted already on the app. But yeah, man, I love you guys once again from the bottom of my heart. Don't forget to be you, do you, stay positive, and just live a little. Thank <laughs> you.